Alright guys, I'm back at the river again. I'm a little bit further up. I'm trying to trace it down and they might meet all the small pieces of goads down there. But if I figure the big, you know, bigger goad is gonna be down here. So I mean up here, I'm sorry. But uh, I'm gonna check up here and see if I can find bigger pieces. Course, wherever it's coming out the hill at or the rocks at uh, it's got to be bigger pieces if all the small pieces goes down so I'm going to see if I can find bigger pieces today I'm trying to track where it's coming from guys but uh alright guys be back in a minute alright guys I found some good trays right there so I went further up the creek and tried to get closer to the walls I can from the river here, so I'm fixing sluice, guys. I'm gonna get in all this right here and start sluicing. Maybe check up behind them big rocks there. Get me a couple of buckets all the way down through here. Just see if there's anything bigger. But uh this is what I got out of it, so y'all can see that. I'm in the sunlight. There's one piece there. A couple pieces there. Alright guys. Tell you what. I'm gonna start sluicing. There's a couple test pans there. Alright. Alright guys. I done moved some of these rocks here. So I'm gonna move these right here. The one that's got dirt on the bottom of them, you like that right there. I just go ahead, rinse it all before I start digging. I'll be done. This small. A lot of times I have go pan to pick up a rock like that right there. And rinse it all individually by itself. And find a good flake on the other side of it. But all right, guys. I'm going to dig right down here while I test pan it. It's bedrock, but it's got all these rocks right here, and that water just circulates right here. I mean, if there's some clay here, but the bigger go will lay on that bedrock if it's a little bit bigger. But all right, well, I'm fixing to get a bucket full of dirt here, sluice it out. All right, all right, guys, I'm gonna test this bucket before I get any more dirt. But there you go, I got that. Then I got the pockets I found. I'm gonna use a, uh, after I finish digging it out, if there's any go after I start sluicing, I'm gonna get my sucker right here, fill it up with water, more water, and suck out the cracks and see what's at the bottom. But first I'm gonna run that. I'm fixing to run right down here. I already got my sluice box set up. All right, guys. Be back in a minute. All right, guys. Thank God, good. Let's see. I'm down in my sluice box right here, man. I got to sit just right, I think. Let's see. Well, so, see what happens. Now, if that spot back there is good, I'll go back and digging and sucking it out. But we'll see. Might have to run it a little harder. Yeah. Yeah. All right, guys. Be back in a minute. I was just trying to catch that fine gold better. All right. All right, guys. I got that much left. I think we can throw it up on the bank here for a while when I get through this. And then I'm going to see if I want to dig there anymore. But uh, I got some couple of pieces right there. Yeah, buddy. I'm in the shade, so it's, it's probably a pain in the butt. I slowed it down so I could catch some heavies. You can see it's catching all them heavies. So, look at the cells, they're filling up. Ooh. If I slice it down, I have to get a pain in it anyway. All right, guys, get back in a minute. <laughs> all right, guys. Ooh. That don't mind a tree in the way. Hey. Alright, this is where I clean them out now. Oh, 
a splash of water from the river on it. Alright guys, be back in a minute. Hey guys, that's what I got. That's some pretty good chunks, but look at the wire and the copper and the shots and everything. There's probably go down in here trap, but I try to tap it out of it and it's kind of hard. So look at that, that's a good piece right there. Alright guys, I'm about trying to beat the hose somewhere or something. But all right, be back in a minute. All right, guys. I'm going to suck that crack out first. Let's put it in my gold pan first and see what's in it. But uh, that's pretty good. Go. I'm a lot more. I'm thinking about, there's a wash coming down the hill right there. I thought about getting right there at the bottom where it circulates that. All right, guys. Be back in a minute. All right, guys. Down there, not the big deep, but the gold must have been laying right on top because... Gotta be laying right there instead of in the cracks. Right there, underneath where the big rocks are. That's right there. But I want to test pan it right there just to make sure right here. That's if it's holding in. I'll be back in a minute, guys. Alright, guys. I want to here. So up here, this big rock right here. I said these big old copy stones and stuff. You see where the water runs around this corner here? And washes down through here. So I'm gonna dig all these cobblestones out and run it through my sluice box, I guess. And I think that goes on top, but I still dig to the bottom, but I thought that goes laying right underneath them rocks. Alright. Back. You can tell when goes start circulating. From there, see right there, I mean, see right there? Look all that. Chips of rocks mixed in that. That's where all that go to circulate in that. It mixes up with that chips, rocks. But yeah, I'm gonna finish digging down through there. <laughs> they might not be much dirty as I thought, but I'm still gonna pick them rocks up. Alright, guys. Be back in a minute. Alright, guys. I dug all that out. Man, man, it's a dirt. Yeah, a little clay. But still. I dug a little pockets out in there and here. I only got about over a little half over a five. So I pour water and anything. Yeah, buddy. And I got to tote that baby. Ah. I pour that water in the pan. I'm going to get me a ghost loose. I'm looking at another one. There's some of this dirty water. Plus, it's like that float go, even them big pieces will float right out of your sluice because it's flat. So, I might be going back. Now, Dream Ant's okay. It's just, uh, I mean, it's easy to clean up and stuff. Now, you get another goose loose. Look at it in the goose loose. But it's got some filters in it at the end, like go, uh, minor moss at the end in little areas. But anyway guys, I'm gonna put some down and slice this out. Be back in a minute. Alright guys. Run this. I got a little more clay dirt and some of that in there, so might be a good thing, we'll see. Sluice, so 
I ain't putting green mat down, but it's for green mat for that heavier gold. So I thought about getting the one with a minor moss in between and these ripples. So I might be getting it in Monday for Tuesday one. So I'm gonna be using it next week. So I'm gonna see if I'm gonna get it in there. Was a see. I'm gonna see if I see any of these. Yeah. All right, man. I'll put y'all back later. All right, guys. I'll fix the corners up on the back, bro. Look at the goat in there, buddy. I'm trying to get y'all to see it. There's a big piece back there. Look at how see it. Yeah, I'm trying to go to that thing, guys. Look at that. See if I can go to the house. That's some pretty good chunks right there, buddy. Let me wet it a little bit. Yeah, look at that one. Ain't that pretty. There's some came out. I said good in the uh, uh, sluice. And I got gold in here. I'm going to suck this up, guys. Look at all this metal right here. Sorry guys. Look at all that metal. Copper wire. Everything is in it. And it's hard to get that big, that big chunk go out of that too. So mix for that sand and heavies. Alright guys, I'm gonna suck this up. And I'm gonna scroll it around and see if there's any more gold, but I'm gonna suck that up first. 